First of all, a very good afternoon to our judges and our audience. Um, this, we are presenting the legend of Masuri. Masuri was a beautiful young woman who lived in Langkawi Island during the reign of Sultan Mustafa Shah Isayen. She was loved and adored by all those who knew her. This is her tale. Home of one Mahora and Dato Pakumba Jayan. Mahora. This is an outrage. After many years of marriage, and he wants to take another wife over my dead body. Who is that wicked woman? No, please don't be angry. I came to tell you as soon as I could. Where is my husband now? In the living room. Masuri. She is said to be of very good character and she comes from a good, very good family. Oh, she sounds like a lovely lady. And I would like to marry her. You want to take a second wife? Yes, I think I'm in love with her. Maura, will you give me the consent to marry Masuri as a second wife? But what? Masuri is truly a fair beautiful lady. But she's much younger than you. She could be a daughter. I understand that age is not a barrier. But what will the North people think? What would they say? You are the Sultan of Kadas officer in Lankawi. And you are also the village chief. Your reputation is very important and must be upheld. But I... Oh, my dearest husband, please think of your duty to the people of Lankawi. You must uphold your reputation, and it gives you a credibility amongst the people. A good leader must have a good reputation. Besides, my brother, one Darus, has, has, has his eye on the same young lady. He is strong and capable young man and he is more suited in each to her. Please allow him to ask for her and in marriage. You have a good point. Okay then, I will allow Wanderers to pursue his love for Masuri. Even with a heavy heart, I will not marry her. Oh, thank you, dear. I have other plans for her. 
And so, Masuri was married to one Mahora's younger brother, Wan Daros. A few months later, a delegation from the palace came to visit Datuk Pakrama Jaya. The country's sovereignty is at stake. I must assemble a battalion of brave men into battle. It is noble to defend your country in times of war. But, dearest husband, you are not young anymore. Each have caught up with you. You were a great warrior in your youth. But now, your reflexes and strength are not what they used to be. Yes, you are right. But who else can we send? Who can lead a company of fighters? My brother, Wan Darus. He is a highly skilled warrior who is both fearsome and fearless. His loyalty to the king will push him to perform in battle and defeat those invaders. Wan Darus is the best person to lead the man. But what about Masuri? Be well taken care at her parents' house. Her mother can care for her until one day is written. She knows best for her daughter. Besides, one must put their country before self. I see. If that is what is best, then it is decided. One day will fight in the war. Mm -hmm. At the home of one day and Mushroom. Masuri moved back to live 
with her mother and father while waiting for her husband to return. She gave birth to a baby boy and named him Wan Hakim.
Oh, just scream. <laughs> um, dearest husband, there is something which I need to tell you. What is it? I did not want to believe it either, but there are talk amongst the people that Monsieur is committing adultery. What? That's unbelievable. Have you checked this out? Don't make wild accusations. How? Oh, don't be curious. This is absolutely true. The maid has seen it with her own eyes. She, she saw Masuri and found Virgil having an affair. Who you knows? They may even be together at home in this very minute. She is not the only one. Some villagers have seen the two of them together many times, going on late in the next quarter. How could she do this? She just had a baby and now she's looking for another man. I hear that she constantly meet each other in secret. What a travesty of justice. She has done such a bad thing. She has betrayed her husband, a loyal, brave young man. I will catch her myself. If what you say is true, I will ensure she is punished. Oh dear, you are very wise. At Masuri's parental home. Here on this beautiful day, 
We share the justice being served and the sinfuls being punished. God, sentence them. What are you two doing here? Our daughter is innocent. She has not committed any crime. Please, let her go. Master is Good girl, she's kind, Philip. She never do such a thing. Silence! Do you know what nonsense you are spouting?
Coco Much, Adios.